Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is the reading for the sign of Pisces for the month of September 2022. Keep in mind, this is a general reading. So you may or may not resonate with this reading. If you do not resonate, please do not try to deliberately fit in. Check in your any other placement, Sun, Moon, Rising or Venus. Also, if you want to book a personal reading, the link is in the description below. You can also follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description below. Also, if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. All right, let's get started with your reading. What are the current energies? What are the current energies for Pisces? Justice is here. All right. What else? Page of Wands. Hmm. I believe the thing is... Hmm. You have been like knowing that some kind of person is coming in your way with a good news with a news that could only be making you happy that could only be making you so satisfied like i have been waiting for this person to give me this news that's what is going to happen all right what else Seven of Wands. Why? Why Seven of Wands? You are struggling with people. people yeah, yeah. There are some aspects in your life where you are struggling. Like people are not happy with you. You are not happy with them. And I can see some sort of struggle here. Alright. What else? Two of Pentacles. Wow. Wow. And you're juggling whether is it worth it or not. You definitely have no idea. You, you're just fighting and fighting and fighting and arguing and arguing. But you have no idea whether you are doing it for the right reason or not. All right. What else? Oh, wow. So many cards came out. Hold on a second. What else? Okay, two cards came. The Hanged Man in Reverse. And there is one more card with the King of Wands is also here. I believe you are no more in the energy of just waiting and waiting. You, there are things that you want, you have been waiting for, but no more. You want to take some actions and you're very fierce about it. Like, it, you're like, enough is enough. I don't want to wait anymore and I want to take some actions. All right. Let's dive into your love life. What are the current energies for the love life of Pisces? What are the current energies for the love life of Pisces? Seven of Pentacles is here. It's a nice card. What else? With five of cups. Okay, I believe you have been waiting uh, for like situations and things and your person to behave in a manner where they actually acknowledge the work that you have put in your relationship. I believe your person is not actually acknowledging the efforts that you have put in the relationship and it's, it's you know, somehow affecting you and as it rightfully should so. All right, let's see what happened in the past between you and your person. What happened in the past? Let's see what happened in the past. All right, it's Ten of Swords. It was a heavy situation for you. With Seven of Swords, some of you might be dealing with Gemini, Libra or Aquarius with the death. Could be a Scorpio also. All right. I believe something has ended something has ended you felt very heavy and that heaviness is gone now uh, there was some heaviness in this relationship and you believe it has gone and it has something to do with your uh you you know you blackmailed your person that's the only what i could think of you blackmailed your person of leaving you of leaving them uh, that's when they realized how much you meant to them. I believe that's only when you could release all the pressure that you were feeling with Ten of Swords, with Seven of Swords in the death. This is this all has ended. The bits and pieces, like after effects, are still there, but I would say the major things have been gone from that heaviness. 
all right let's find out what are the intentions of the person what are the intentions of the person you have been dealing with what are the intentions of the person what are the intentions of the person oh wow wheel of fortune is here what else with three of pentacles uh they definitely see something in you uh they feel like they have you know gained some sort of lottery by being with you for sure that's not a negative uh they might have been behaving in a very different manner earlier but that's not what they intend to do their actual intentions are very different i believe their actions are very different from what they you know think and uh, what they feel about you all right let's find out what are the blockages in this relationship what are the blockages in this relationship knight of swords is here they are come uh, oh they are not opening up to you or they are not very much clear to you 100% open to you two of wands there is so much of waiting here the high priestess oh shit it's like you know it's very frustrating to see these cards together like i can understand your frustration the level of frustration with these are blockages man uh what is wrong with this person and what is wrong with this situation talk to each other many of things will get cleared for your own benefit if it works out it works out it does not if it did not work out it was not meant to work out but don't you know uh, don't uh, be in so much of sufferings uh, talk to each other the blockage is the communication and no no clarity to each other all right what is coming in the future what is coming in the future what is coming in the future eight of cups wow what else with five of pentacles wow someone is going to ghost someone because they are emotionally detached what else with the magician trying to win them back trying to win you back what else the uh, yeah uh there is going to be a time a period of separation but you would definitely do some manifestation work to get this person back or it could be a reverse role like uh, you will leave them and they will be doing performing some you know manifestation hacks to get you back all right let's find out what are the messages from the universe for you what are the messages from the universe for you what are the messages Yeah. light in the unexpected all right you will find your answer in the very unexpected uh, road so don't be afraid to take a turn where you're very not sure about it all right what does your soul say ask yourself what you need really crave what you really want what you really need all right what else one more card lead your metamorphosis okay you know you should uh, be more humble towards people and do not overspend over unnecessary things spend on helping people it will definitely come back to you all right that's it for the reading thank you